Alright, so look, it's day one, right? Yes. I'm Chef Boy on ET right now, okay? I made my shells already. I, 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 you know what I'm saying? I, I, I cooked the shells, fried them up. I made the, I made the steak. Now I'm making guacamole. Now I make my guacamole different, you know, being from California, you know, you grow up around so many different type of people, Spanish cultures and stuff, so but my secret to my guacamole I think it's really great. Grocery bags. You put avocados, right? You know, get the good kind. In the future, after you cut it in half, spoon it out. Spring break grub. Alright. So I put that in there. Got all my avocados in there. I'm gonna spoon in some tomatoes. Not too much. You don't want like overwhelm it. Oh shit. I probably look like I'm fucking high as hell right now. Okay. Alright, so I put this in there, I'll take one more spoon. Just make a baby spoon. Alright. So look. Sea salt. Load it up, cause, it's, cause you're gonna laugh when you see me do this shit. So I load it up there, sea salt. Can a truck change how people feel about a guy? Who talked to real people, not actors. I know why they do this. But there's not Everyone, when they first get their seasoning, just pop the thing and try to just shake it in this fucking thing. Don't lie. Yeah, I'm way more sex This guy is definitely the guy your mom wants you to marry, and this is the guy you're gonna run off to and leave that in there. You know you want a truck. The all new Chevy Colorado. Motor Trends 2015 Truck of the Year. Yeah, I've got a lot of problems with it. Right now with Burger King, get 10 chicken nuggets for just a dollar. So, no. Is that my truck? No avocado, no guacamole is complete without cilantro. If you're eating guacamole without cilantro, I don't know what you're doing in your life. Alright. I figured that right there should be enough. So I'm taking my knife to chop this shit off. Ghetto kitchen, so don't 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 judge me. Shit is fucked up, watch. I wish this shit had some other video. Y'all can smell this shit in here. It's fucking good. It's alright. Take your cilantro, whatever you gonna use, right? I try to use the leaves, but you know. Whatever. Get your little your knife, whatever your knife, you gotta chop it up with pieces. Be improved today because we make the decision, not some other bank. And your car is back by 24 24. I know y'all over here like, does ET think he really knows how to cook? Believe it or not, I actually do. My uncles are chefs. Grandfather knew how to cook really well. Plus, I watch stupid shit like cooking channels. Yes, my hands are clean. So, you try to chop this up as best as you can. We're in Panama, by the way. PCV. So, it's not like they give you like the best utensils in these fucking up condos. They just give you knives and forks and fucking turn Most people eat pizza and shit. I don't eat that shit. Alright, so I got my seasonings in there, I have my avocados, I have my dash, I have some tomatoes, these are actually um, basil garlic diced tomatoes though, just if you guys want to FYI, so I put my cilantro in here, okay, this shit be so good, I wish y'all could smell it, alright, and this is how I actually make my guacamole. Dirty girls love this shit, by the way. All I do, clear all the air out the bag, and I squash it. <laughs> I 
I squash it in a bag. That's all I do. And I squash it, squash it, squash it. Until I, I feel barely any more lumps in there. America, did you file your taxes with someone else last year? Right. All the seasonings are getting mixed up, all the cilantro. I don't have to do no bowl and all this shit. It's so ghetto, I know. I don't give a shit. It comes out like fucking beer. Heaven. So, as you can see, the colors starting to change, starting to look more like rock and roll. Introducing the new bar snacks and You know, nothing makes you want to show up I guess people can put in there what they want, but cilantro is like I have to, right? Sea salt for a lot less And depending on how, how hot you want to make it, I don't like mine too hot. Some people put onions in there. Onions are pretty good. I don't have the onions don't go away. This episode of Ridiculousness so, continues right now. It's almost done. A couple more months to get out. It's like filling a gooey breast. Okay. We went to prom recently. How did that happen? I think that's well, pretty much it. That I've never met before. Right. He so I'm gonna grab my bowl. And he made a YouTube video of me actually inviting him to the first. She turned him down. So then he invited me. So I was like, I'm just. I thought he was cute. Right. This cute little boy, Jake. Okay. Well, let's take a look at what happens when you poke a hole in it. They treat it like a. You ever see them pastry chefs and they're oh, shh, shh, ghetto a version, motherfucker. You went to prom. There's a part of me that where you got half of it. I squeeze that shit out. Like the problem was about to start. You did a little bit of like. I didn't do anything half out. I didn't do anything half out. I was half out of the party though because I was too old. You were drunk? Yeah. Yeah. No, I was sober. There it is. Let's squeeze that shit out. Yeah. Let's take a look at this. No, 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 this is, this is the course, uh, that's the food in here. And believe it or not, this is like the best, this shit tastes so good. I know y'all are like, E.T., you're fucking crazy. Yes, I am. But I also know how to make good ass food. <laughs> Welcome to the Chef Boy R.E.T. kitchen, nigga. PCB, nigga. Yeah.